Hello everyone, Mikey here. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be doing uh, episode 5 of Mario Superstar Baseball. And this time we're going to be starting the flower level. Uh, in the last episode we completed the mushroom difficulty. We got a few star missions done. We beat Bowser. Uh, but now we're going to be moving on to the next difficulty and to the next team. We're going to be playing as Donkey Kong this time. Because his is the second worst, in my own opinion. Uh, even though Yoshi is definitely my favorite Mario character, I can put my bias aside and say that he is, he's got a pretty bad team. So, I think what I want to do is because this team is going to struggle a lot with power, I think I want to start with Mario. As far-fetched as it might be, because he is like the most powerful team on the uh, apart from Bowser, but I don't think this will be too much of a problem. I don't think it should cause too many uh, issues to start off with. But ah, uh, I'll keep it like that. It's not exactly you know, expecting the world. Excuse me, from uh, this team. So, just trying to get a good basis covered and try and get as many missions as I can done uh, to start off with. But what I want to do before we start is check what star missions we have. So I need to make a big play and crack a long hit, which is make a big play is kind of just like a dive and catch kind of thing. Diddy Kong, I need to pitch and bat with the boomerang ball and win, and strike out Baby Mario. So I will need to buy his item, but I, oh, I do already have his item. So I do need to put Diddy Kong in the mount, and I will have to strike out Baby Mario eventually when we get to that point. I need to hit a home run, score a run with banana ball swing, and drive and run versus Mario. Uh, let's see. So I haven't done anything with Goomba or Paragoomba yet. I need to crack a long hit with Koopas, and I need to smack a hit and cross on play. Okay, that's not bad. So I will be sure to put uh, Diddy Kong on the, excuse me, the mount, so that he can get his challenge done. Ah, close. Sorry. So let's go ahead and get his batting one out of the first. That actually was not a bad hit. Right not gonna even lie, that was not too bad. Now, if I can hit a home run with Donkey Kong, it'd be much appreciated. Well... Back, 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 back. I can't go back, I can't go back. Well, it was a perfect hit, but I think the field might be a little bit too big. Not a problem, so... And that's not it. Oh. Okay, well, to be fair, that touched the ground first, at least it looked like it to me. I don't know if I was just wrong or not, but... Oh, wrong, wrong thing. Oops, sorry. That's fine. Oh, I did it wrong. Oops. So one thing you're going to notice a lot more during this playthrough of Flower Difficulty is going to probably end up giving a, up a lot more hits, because with the increase in difficulty they definitely become like, wow that was like the same exact hit, but <clears throat> they definitely get a lot uh, better. Like they're a lot more accurate. Okay, well here's the problem with, uh, here's definitely another problem is that, oh, well uh, there goes that scout mission, I guess. So now I need to get three outs in a row, Wario's up to bat. Well, okay, so this might have been a bad idea. In hindsight, this definitely was not a great choice. But, I can't, it's kind of too late to back out, so I'm gonna have to just... Hope to God I can find a rhythm. I'm not sure how I'm liking this. Okay, that worked out well. But my big worry is with this man right here, because King Boo is known to completely just crack one over the wall in any given moment, and I'm very, very worried that it's just going to I'm going to try and play it a little bit safer than I normally would, because I really don't want anything bad to happen. Okay. 
a Magikoopa, I'm not as worried about. If I can actually strike Magikoopa out, I'd be very open. But not expecting the world for myself to be completely true. Got to lock in a little bit. I might have actually just screwed myself over, so that's... Yep, I screwed myself up. Nice. Well, that's, um... That could have gone a lot better. So I got the out, but I also ended up giving up three runs off four hits. So we might be in a bit of a predicament. Um, I don't really feel like restarting, because I want to see if I can actually bring this back. I might actually might have to actually restart though, because that was pretty bad. Um, I think uh, if there's one person I trust. To go, go. I'm gonna I'm gonna run all the way to third. So. I would have run home had I known that he was gonna get hit by Ching Chong. I'm happy either way. Uh, It's not that I don't doubt that I can bring this back, but the fact of the matter that, like, I just gave up three runs in an inning, so I pretty much have to to match that, which is not very likely to be completely truthful. Oh, that's bad. As long as I can, like, complete a few star I don't think star missions count unless you do. So, unless I'm mistaken. It's been a while, but... Uh, I'm not really... Enthusiastic about paratroopers having. Oh my god, you're lying. <sighs> okay, so. This is not exactly a great start. Dude, I have very bad, uh, very bad outfield, so honestly I'm better off just letting the ball roll instead of chasing it. If I can strike out Petey, that honestly might be too bad. Ooh, he's getting a little bit too close for comfort. What's even worse about this entire game going on right here is that I'm not even getting any scout flights, so I'm not even making any progress. So even if I manifest some sort of comeback, it's not going to matter because I'm not even getting any progress towards anything. So Hopefully DK... Okay, so DK is up to bat. If I can get Dixie and Diddy on base, that could give me a good leeway into pat, like just knocking one over the wall. Question is if I if I could if I mess this up with Dixie I'm probably okay. so that doesn't help my case. It's all relying on uh, Donkey Kong here. Now to come back. Oh, score well. Nope, that was bad. Well. I did what I needed to do. I scored a run, but I have to score a few more if I want to give myself some leeway, because first, the bottom of the first inning was really bad. Like, Goomba, I have no faith in. Should have had more faith in him, to be honest. He actually put in 100% effort. Paragoomba needs to also come into play. Nope, oh, back, 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 back. I can't run fast enough. Please! Okay. Oh, Koopa I can rely on. I can rely on Koopa. Please, Tornado, please, Tornado, please, Tornado. So all that was for nothing. I wasn't kidding when I said it kind of ramps up the difficulty, but to be completely fair, I, I did choose probably, arguably, the worst team. So, 
I kind of want to say that Yoshi's is worse, but to give Yoshi's team some credit, they actually have some uh, some speed on their team, as opposed to Donkey Kong's team. So what I think we're going to instead do is we're going to try and not face Bowser Jr. We're going to go for Mario's team, because I think that they could give us some valuable players. Because that was not a great start, I'm going to be completely honest. Just realized my fan was on. Um, I guess I can keep Diddy Kong on the the mound just for now. I want to. I think I want to change this up a little bit to start with my to start with these guys and then have like the. I guess that's a little bit better. I don't know if that really did much, but we're gonna go with anyway, just because I don't know really how to make this any better, and I don't really feel like changing the positions in the field right now. So. I'll leave the slow Paracoopa to be out there. But, or sorry, Paratroopa. That was atrocious. But. So if he, if he could have like dropped it, that would have been nice. But. Really? Well, that's a much better start. That completes one of uh, Donkey Kong's star missions. So that's best case scenario so far is Donkey Kong just getting one run and us winning. Nokia would have fumbled it. Mario Sunshines. Finish one off in three batters. It's asking a lot. His computers don't seem to play. I do need to strike out baby Mario, and I got the driving runs against Mario's team as Donkey Kong as well, so that. So now I need a double play. And I'm not very good at setting those up, so let's just up, let's just throw a ball. Let's just throw it and hope they hit it. Any day now, just hit the ball. Not like that. This is my only chance of actually. Uh... Why was it not just throwing changeups the whole changeups the whole time? I know it's risky to try this with Mario, but that's why it works out. That's why. It... I knew it was risky going for it against Mario, but I didn't really care. So I knew it was a last resort. And that completes, I'm pretty sure that completes one of Dixie's challenges. So please don't. Got an actual challenge with her. Uh, her. At least I think it. Wow, Goomba actually hitting big. Everybody came to play today. That's or I guess I guess the the loss in Mario. I don't know if that just like motivated me to play a little bit like at ease and just kind of autopilot into hitting the ball better, uh, better, or if like I'm genuinely just like kind of learning the controls a little bit better or relearning the controls rather. But for better or for worse, we have Diddy Kong at the, uh, the plate, and unfortunately, I need to do a. Uh, Okay, well. So I don't get to do that, I guess. Uh, Alright. Once again, uh, Donkey Kong is showing that he is the. probably in the top, like, three best hitters in the game. Just without question. His consistency is unmatched. So. Find a more consistent hitter other than like 
PD Piranha than Donkey Kong, because King Boo is... He has more power on his hits, but he doesn't hit them consistently in the field. He always is, like, cracking them to the foul ball territory. So. Honestly, if I can mercy Mario, I would be very happy. But I'm not expecting that. Because I know that I can... I'm gonna get out here in a second, because I have Paragoomba and Goomba after that. Told you. Baby Mario up to bat anytime soon? I need to strike Baby Mario out. Forget if I already struck him out. Um, I might have. Nice. I probably haven't struck out Baby Mario because I don't think he's been up to bat yet. That would explain it. As long as Diddy Kong can strike Baby Mario out, I will walk away with the experience pretty positive. Uh oh. I almost just fumbled my controller. Nope, that's not very good. Okay, I'm gonna lose my mind. It's not, it's not. I'm genuinely gonna lose my mind. Getting any scout flags in time soon, but maybe I can get a few from pitching. Wow, Baby Mario's not. Oh, Baby Mario. I'm thinking of Super Sluggers. Baby Mario's on the other team. Baby Mario's on uh, Yoshi's team. And I'm going to slow brain day. Completely forgot that Baby Mario's on the other team or on Yoshi's team in this game. I guess got an okay, uh, okay ending. I mean, I got a f like got a few star missions done, but like I'm still kind of upset about the uh, the whole uh, fiasco with Wario. So I need to score a run with the banana wall swing, get a few. So pretty much, I just have getting his items done. Okay. And Dixie needs to crack a long hit. Paraguma needs to make a jumping catch. I'll try that next episode. Uh, pitch the whole game and win. I can do that. But I also have the problem of striking out. So what I'll do is I think I'm going to wait to face Beaver, to face Yoshi's team. I'll go with probably Peach's next. Actually, wait. What other team? Yeah, I'll go with Peach's team next. And then I will pitch the whole game with the Paratroopa. 
probably win. Uh, and then when we face Yoshi's team, Diddy Kong will be back on his, his regular place. But that's going to do it for today's episode. I think this was pretty much an alright start. It wasn't the best start possible, but it definitely uh, you know gave us a good starting point for Flower Difficulty. Uh, if y'all enjoyed this video, please let me know in the comments or what I can do better for future uploads. This is Mikey, signing off.